Okay, so here we are, round two. Uh, we're looking at the uh, Godzilla, the R32, or to give it correct title, the Nissan Skyline GT R brackets BNR 32 close brackets JGTC. <sighs> I'll keep somebody happy. Anyway, the thing won this series four years in a row, so it deserves to be in here. So we're going to take it out for a, a spin around a Sugo. You're wondering why I looked up there then, because I was double checking. Um, so we're going to take it around Sugo, which is available. You can have that one. I'll leave a link in the description and below. And yeah, we'll not mention the Porsche 6921C. T42911. No, no. It's just too many, too many numbers after a car's name. Just call it the, the I don't know, just call it something different. Give it a name. Call it Bessie or something. Okay, so just let me check what I'm on here. We were on slicks, it's wet. Why not? Uh, AI is set to 110% as yesterday and medium aggression. We've got seven laps around here. Uh, it's just a bit wet and raining at the beginning and then it dries up. So I've no idea where it's going to be wet because whoa obviously I'm sorry, I had to take the escape route there, otherwise known as the grass. Um, so I don't know where it's going to be wet because it's uh, the, uh, the old weather 3.0 system and I can't get my power on without this thing just absolutely wanting to go sideways whoa come on guys it's causing absolute mayhem uh, we have got uh, the names I can't see when my braking zone is anybody see bright lights so we've got the uh, names AI pack on. They were ready in the wings, ready to go because they hit it that quick for the two new cars. Again, I'll leave a link in the description below for that one. Just let the car settle out on the first lap. Hopefully we've not collected too much damage. Let me check. One on the front. Everything else is all right. The big thing about this is managing them back tires can uh, cook them very easily okay somebody's coming in obviously he started on wet so he started on slicks or something again can't see a thing oh my god right monza anybody what am i saying monza limons even <clears throat> yeah okay leave it in warts and all Try again. This time we'll try and get a bit of traction. Come on, Godzilla. Better. It's now an eight lap race. Hey, it wasn't me. They just, you know, I was looking at brake lights and I couldn't tell for the rain lights to put on. Okay, first lap shenanigans. Everybody is crowded in I'm not going over there again come on Lambo you're doing using the handbrake ah, I was still cooking these back tyres easy tiger what throttle and just counter steering on the straight line this thing is just a monster not got gym on because yeah it's there's a restricting order against him for at least a week well, again can't see there's some bright lights oh, oh locking up all the way in there and uh, the car has got a downshift auto blipper on which is a godsend really because I can imagine without it this thing will be locking up everywhere Trying to tiptoe, but it is quite a short course. This, um, and at the moment, I'm just fighting for uh, traction. 
So if I see a gap, I can't get the, uh, the power down to get through it. So we'll just let it dry up, which it should do very soon. Clear a bit of this, that's my headlights. Something there. Oh, it's the tank. Track is still damp, but it's not raining anymore, so it's just going to get better from here. Maybe we can uh, use a bit of that power and get it on the tarmac. Around the outside? No. Hobbling over the curbs. Short shifted to third, why not? Down to second. Supra looking at the inside really careful about getting it on the grass on the exit of here so we'll have a moment whoa okay quick on the gears there Well, they put the curbs there, we'll use all of them. Can I get up the inside? Can I get there? Having a bit of a battle, he's looking up the inside. It's a bit wet up there. Slowly try and get that power on. Right, full throttle now. Um, yeah, I mean, what was going to say? The car model is beautiful, which you come to expect now. Um, physics wise, yeah, it's uh, again, it's individual from newer cars and it feels like a monster. Somebody's had a crash up ahead, so we'll take advantage of that. Come on, come on, guys. Give me all that room there. Why, why pile into my door? Salty. <laughs> Got that Porsche up behind me. I'm just waiting for this. Uh, Oh, she's give me a clunk as well. Come on. This truck is a little bit small for these big beasts. Porsche's a bit nippy around the corners. He's just going to go up the insides and here. Yeah. We've got the power on him. Come on, come on. Right, all right, you covered the outside. I was cut back. Ah! Fooled you. He's still there, is he? No, he's gone behind. And right, now we can get the power on the, uh, the track. He's drying up. Give me a quiet one just to catch up with these guys. Auto blipper on the downshifts just saved my feet so much out of So we'll uh, talk through what gears I'm doing and what lines I'm taking through here as we start the, uh, the lap again. Try and get up on these guys. Yeah, we've, got, we've hooked it in, we've hooked it in. Just try and control it. Okay, start, finish straight. Ooh, double right under at the end of it. Second gear braking. Three, two, one. Now. Okay, treat it as one big long corner. So come all the way out and all the way back in. Next corner, third gear. Cut it nice and tight. Not like that. Second gear. This is horrendously tight. 
That will do a late entry. Didn't work, not enough room. Through the chicane, second gear all the way through. Pop it to third, we're going to be breaking back down to second. Another double right hander. Watch your exit on here. You can use a bit of curve, but it's not that wide. And if you touch the grass, uh, you're going to. You, yeah, yeah. It's not good in these cars. Or in this car. Okay, breaking down to second again. Trying to hook it in. Up to third. Shifted it there, leave it in third, run it wide, it's like a double left hander again. Third, run it wide. There's a big apex. I'm gonna try to fool this guy, cut him. There you go. Second one's not having any of it. So, if you can stay on deep in here, you can get more traction. And that is a lap of Sugo in the R32. Come on, come on, I gave you room, gave you room. Quite, the quite aggressive the AI in these. So one of the biggest things I've found with this car is conserving your tires. It's a big car, it's got a lot of power. And as you can see, my front left is a little bit orange. My rears are a little bit orange. And he's got the inside line, give it to him quite clear him. No. Nope. That's a back out. Car models are spot on. Lay brake going in there. All sorts of slip angles coming through. Woo! Uh, this is the F84. It's good, it's one of the better, better, and they're all good. It's one of the better cars out of the pack. The R32, it's a bit more raw. I would say if you're into kind of more uh, frills, you prefer the R32. Godzilla's got it all for you. Oof. Let's shift down there to second. You can hang this thing out. You can just play around with slip angles at the expense of your rear tyres, of course. I'm just spinning all the way up the hill there. Ah, we've got some traction. What lap are we on? seven last lap and yeah there you go tires are killing down somebody's got a problem up ahead somebody's got a major problem he's pulled off nice and that's what you get with the names pack it's going to be more of that with uh, version 1.6 by the way if you watch the uh, dev vlogs and the videos the cars retiring out can't do anything with the nsx you know what happened last time in the porsche Sat me at the rear. I've got a good hook in there. I'm in fourth. Can I hold it? No. I can hold it, but I just haven't got enough power out of the bends. Right, thanks for watching. Absolutely love these cars. All the links will be in the description below. It's so good not to hear Jim. Right, adios.